Hello, today we are going to learn how to divide any circle into 14 equal parts. The first step is to draw a horizontal diameter which cuts our circumference at points P and Q as shown here in the video. So the next step is to draw a perpendicular vertical diameter giving us two new points which we will call A and H. So the next step is to set our compass on the point H and with a radius HO we are going to scribe an arc which cuts our circumference at two new points which we will call point R and point S as can be seen here. So the next thing we're going to do is to join these two points R and S with a horizontal line as can be seen here in the video, which cuts our vertical diameter at a new point, which we will call T. And now the distance or T is the distance that divides the circumference of the circle into seven equal parts. So starting from point A and dividing each of these segments in half, by starting at point H, we will get 14 equal divisions. So first we set our compass to the length RH as can be seen here and we set our compass on the point A and we're going to scribe 7 arcs. Okay, there's our first one. And now we continue setting our compass on the next arc. We can continue and be careful to work with precision and accuracy to make sure that you're position your compass exactly on each arc. And if we've been working with precision and accuracy, our last arc should cut exactly on point A. And now we've divided the circumference into seven equal parts. And now this time with the same radius and setting our compass on point H, we're going to scribe another seven arcs, as can be seen here. And this divides our previous seven arcs exactly in half. So this will divide now our outer circumference into 14 equal parts, which we want. And again, if we've been working with accuracy, our last division should cut exactly on point H, as can be seen here. So the next step is to name the final 14 divisions, A, B, C, D, E, all the way to N. Okay, which I have done in a red line and you will get a tetra decagon or a 14 sided regular polygon inscribed in the circle and joining these 14 points to the center point O with a blue line we get 14 equal divisions or circular sectors which you can see highlighted here in the video. So I hope this video has helped you. Please press like or subscribe to our YouTube channel. Thank you until the next time.